Hello, guys. In this video, we will look at some tools that support teamwork in Clever Staff. Let me remind you about five user roles in our system. The account administrator adds the users through the tab organizer and invite a new user, or from the section users. There are five roles in total, four of which are intended for your work in the company and are paid. And one role is completely free and is intended for your customers, inside your company or your agency's customers. The first four roles are, admin is a role with full access to the company account which allows to manage other users, customers, vacancies, and candidates. Recruiter has full access to customers, vacancies, and candidates. Freelancer is a role with limited access. He only has access to the customers, vacancies, and candidates for whom he is responsible, not the full company's database. Researcher is a role with limited access. He can only access vacancies and candidates that he is in charge of. The addition of a freelancer to a vacancy allows him to view both his own candidates and all the candidates who are applying for the vacancy, which is another difference between a freelancer and a researcher. In this situation, the researcher will only see the candidates he manually added. Hiring manager is a role with limited access. It is free to add. The number of hiring managers is unlimited. He can only access vacancies and candidates that he is in charge of. Adding a new user is very simple. You need to enter an email, select a role, and send an invitation. Additionally, the hiring manager may choose the vacancy from the menu to which he will be added. But even without this option, he can be added to the system. Let's show some features by taking the account of John Hiring Manager as an example. Let's add SQL Developer to the vacancy. To do this, let's open the vacancy. Then, go to the vacancy details. And add new responsible. That's it. John became a hiring manager for this vacancy. Let's now open John Hiring Manager's account and see what it looks like for him. So, the user sees a reminder bar with a description of his role as a hiring manager. Additionally, there is a bell indication in the upper right corner indicating who added the user to the vacancy as well as when it happened. Now, as an administrator, let's go to the users section and do a more fine-tuning of the hiring manager's features. You can disable the user permanently. Hide customers. Open the employee's profiles. View attachments. View the candidate's salary. Similarly, the administrator can grant and revoke access to specific functions from other employees. I'd like to introduce the Clever Staff Systems tool for mentioning users, which also applies to hiring managers. For example, let's open the SQL vacancy. Then, open the candidate's profile and mention any employees in the comments. Put the at symbol, at sign, to do this, and now we can choose. To mention the hiring manager, we must first pick show to the associated hiring manager, and then we can mention this hiring manager as well. By default, the hiring manager does not see comments on candidates and this permission must be given separately. So now we can mention our John and write, for example, pay attention to this candidate. And click post. This particular comment will now be available to the hiring manager, and he'll be notified on this mention. Let's go back to John's account. He received a new notification that he had been mentioned on the candidates page by user Jenny Parker. And we can go and read the comment. In the same way, notifications will be sent to any other team member who will be mentioned in the comments. I hope this video was helpful, friends. You may always get in touch with our technical support team if you have any questions.